So here's the outside of 126 Hummingbird. It's got a side entry garage. It is on a corner lot. The house next door just sold. So we've got expanded driveway with a gate on the side over here. And you've got a walkway around the house to the front door. Nice brick color. Okay, so they brought the fence out a little bit on the front here so they could have a more of a side yard. There is, so that is a dead end right there, and then you tee into Moriarty Street with the stop sign. So let's go inside and take a look. Alright, so here's the garage. It looks pretty deep and tall, and they've got whatever this is, a Bronco, an old Bronco or something in here. So I think your Jeep will fit. And I did, uh, here's, they've got, um, pull down stairs. And I did notice they have, um, gutters with leaf guard around. Hi, Cash. Hi, sweet girl. Hello. You got a little mohawk. Hi. All right. So it's got tile. Hi, baby. Hello. Here's your HVAC unit. Looks good. Let's see. All right, so we have the kitchen. Looks like front door. There's a door to the side yard. Let's see. I see you. So that is tile. Got lots of fans. All right. So you've got granite countertops. Lots of cabinets. It's a Frigidaire Professional Refrigerator. Whoa. All right, so here's your freezer. And your fridge. Cabinets. Oh, so it's missing the handle here. Hmm. Well, I don't know how we're going to open that. We used to have this one actually. It's a nice. Um, there we go. Dishwasher. Can't really see much down here. There we go. Let's do it here. Looks good. I see you. Well, they've got a little water filter system. There we go. I've got the little plant ledge there. Huge pantry. A little door action. Could use a little touch up paint. I don't know if it's going to show through, but see, like here and here and here. Nothing bad though. I noticed it along right here too. Let's see if we can get some more lights on. Alright, so you got the front door, you got this 
open area space. So this is just a carpet. Or is it? Yeah, just a carpet. Let's see. So here, this is the front. And then that goes to the side yard. Here's a view from this angle. It's really bright in here, sorry. Okay. So the front room and the front door is behind me. Here's your first bedroom. It's a good size room. The carpet feels cushy. Good size closet. I mean, it goes the, almost the whole width of the wall here. And this is a front bedroom. So you've got a Jack and Jill bathroom because there's another bedroom right there. Let me clean this off. Hold on one second. There we go. So you've got a tub shower combo, toilet, one sink, and a very tiny little closet, but it does its purpose. So you do have a, t a tile surround, which is nice. And it is a garden tub. And little pocket doors. Okay, so here's your second bedroom. Where's the light? There is no light. All right, let's see. There we go. All right. So again, good size room. This is also a front bedroom. And then your closet. Again, really good sized closets. So front door is out that way, kitchen was this way. Good size hallway here, another bathroom. So again, tub shower combo. This time it's just a regular tub, sink and toilet, and you have another linen closet, marble top. A little dings here and there, but nothing too bad. We've got a pocket door again. We'll come through the other way so that we can turn the light on. There we go. So again, good size room. It's a full size bed, and they've got a little armchair. So this is side garage or side bedroom because there's a driveway. And then a little walk-in closet. There we go. So it does go all the way around in a U-shape. It's good size rooms. And you've got crown molding here. That's pretty. All right, let's go get the master. So again, front door, all those bedrooms are back behind me. You're a very good girl. All right, here we go. All right, so here's your master. Barn door on the... There we go. 
barn door in the bathroom. It's a good size room. You've got the crown molding as well. This one goes to the side. 